Hey guys, Alicia from The Athletic Generation. Hope you're all doing well today. I'm on here with a little AliExpress haul. So these are some things that um, have been trickling in recently and also a couple of things that um, have taken over four months to arrive. So um, the first thing that took forever were these pink Velcro dots. <laughs> I'd mentioned these previously in so many of my videos um, saying how my pink Velcro dots hadn't arrived and I'm pretty sure I ordered these back in June and it is now November so that's how long these pink Velcro dots took to arrive so just keep that in mind when you're ordering um, that these are going to take quite a long time to turn up um, so yeah, that's the first thing. So I thought I'd show that first because yeah, it is something I ordered back in June and yeah, it's only just arrived now. So, but in saying that they're like a really nice um, size for your projects and I love that you can get them in other colors that um, instead of like rather than white or just black. So I love that they come in pink. Um, next, these took quite a while as well. So these are some resin crosses that I ordered for Halloween crafting. And they've only, I think they arrived pretty much right on Halloween actually. So they were a bit delayed, but I can use these for any other projects. You don't have to use them for Halloween. Um, but yeah, they did take quite a long time to turn up as well. I think they took a good two to three months from memory, but they are gorgeous. They're, um, they're like a black resin one and even the hook on them is resin as well. And they've also got little speckles of glitter through them. So I'm pretty sure you get about 10 of these. Well, there's two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, so you get ten of the black crosses. So you could use them for all year round crafting if you want to. You don't have to use them just for Halloween. I tend to um, enjoy using crosses when I'm playing with All Heart, and I like to do 80s inspired, um, I guess, like Madonna. Um, type crafting <laughs> I don't know just crosses remind me of 80s and Madonna so um, yeah I tend to use them for when I'm crafting for those types of projects and I also grabbed I'll just move these to the side I also grabbed some in pink And you get 10 of these ones as well so I thought I'd go the black and the pink because like I said it goes perfect with the um, crepe paper all heart collection well I think it does and they're a really lovely pink like this such a pretty color oh I've got two there that are stuck together there we go so they are really, really lovely. And these also have the um, the glitter through them as well. And that's what the backing looks like. So I'll leave all the links down below so you guys can go and find these products easily because I don't remember how much I paid for things. Um, so... Um, yeah, and it'd be different too based on um, which country you're from as well. The prices um, vary. So, yeah, very, very cute crosses. And I think these were also, I ordered these around the same time as the crosses for, I'm pretty sure I ordered these so I could use them just for my summer crafting to maybe go with some of the Obed Marshall collections like um, Buenos Dias. I just thought they'd be really fun 
to add to my summer project. So I'll just show you some of them, what they look like. So they're in multiple um, colours. And again, these are like resin as well. But they've got a beautiful pastel sort of ombre effect. As you guys can see there, they are really pretty. Like lots and lots of fun, sherbet-y, like gelato colours. And I thought these would be really cute just to dangle onto, yeah, my summer, summer project what I'm crafting with my summer collections which we are going into very soon almost summer here now which is great it's um it's my favorite season uh, summer I just love the warm weather my body doesn't do so great in winter I'll find that um, I'm actually at my sickest and um, unhealthiest during winter my body just hates it that much and I'm always my healthiest um, in spring and summertime I just think I just I need that sunshine and that beautiful warm weather <laughs> so those are really cute so then I'll stick with maybe some of the sort of summery crafting stuff I also grabbed these giant pink paper clips and they're a beautiful, almost like a lilac pink sort of colour. They're really pretty. And these are perfect to make giant dangly um, charms as well as like banner embellishments, I find. And you can add these in your journals as well into like a book. Use them as a bookmark if you wanted to with a couple of little charms on the end. They're super cute. I just love the colour. They are so pretty. And you get a really good amount in there. Let me just see how many. Um, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think I have taken a couple out actually, maybe to use or to gift. I don't think you get seven. I have a feeling I may have got 10 of these, but I can't quite remember. Like I said, I'll leave the links down below and then you guys can um, go, go find them. Um, so next I might actually, oh, sorry, my voice got a bit funny there. Um, get into, I've just got a couple of Halloween things that I ordered. I only just ordered these recently because I wanted to do like a little top up just um, so I have them in my stash ready for next year's Halloween. So I ended up grabbing some of these little charms that say Boo. And I ordered these not too long ago. So they arrived quite quick, these ones, which is what I love. Love it when things arrive nice and quick from AliExpress. So they just say boo. So I thought they'd be perfect just to stick in my little um, embellishment box of charms ready for next year. And they've just got a silver, um, a silver backing to them. But they're a nice size. I'm quite happy with that size. And being white, they can go with any style of Halloween crafting. And then I loved using these little spider web charms so much in my crafting this year that I decided to get some more. But I got them in a multi-pack this time. So I ended up getting, they come in, I think, just black and white um, spider webs. But yeah, I thought I'd get some of the different colors so you get six and yeah this is like the mixed pack of black and white spider webs and they're gold as well so i hope my camera is focusing i can't see where my camera is it's that high above me so i just hope that it all works out <laughs> I can't really tell until I've finished filming how things turned out. Um, so keep that in mind, guys. Um, I grabbed some of these 
they're meant to be like bead spaces, like gold bead spaces, but I'm not too sure about the quality on these. I don't like that they've, I don't know, they haven't been painted, like the whole thing hasn't been painted. So they look nice and gold on the side, which is how you would see them. But when you face them up the right way, they're looking a bit grey and, and silver sort of on the top and on the back. So I don't know, we'll just have to wait and see how these end up um, looking once I add them to some projects. But I thought gold would be lovely and I don't have any gold spaces and I also don't use a lot of spaces when I'm doing wire wrapped beads. So I'm looking forward to using the gold like in between like a bead. I think that would look really nice. Um, I've got some Christmas goodies. I might show them last, actually. So. Oh, I must have grabbed more. Um, what do you call them? Clasps. Lobster clasps um, in gold. So I've got like a smaller size. And then I also grabbed some in a bigger size just for all the different types of um, dangles that you could be making. So I've been buying quite a few lobster clasps lately and like um, jump rings as well to make all my dangly danglies, dangly charms, key rings. So these are quite a nice size. They're not too big and then not too little and you get a good amount in there I reckon that's probably maybe a 50 pack or something like that so I'll just try and get them back in without spilling them everywhere so yeah they're a nice size and then you've got the bigger ones so for more sort of your bigger dangly Dangly charms and key rings that you want to create. So they're quite nice. You good you get a good amount of um, these ones too, in a way, because I mean they're a lot bigger, but yeah, what two, four, six. Um, I think you get ten. So that's those. And then we'll move on to kind of Christmas and then that's all I've got left to show you so I ended up grabbing these pretty little bow charms but you only get four in this um, size pack but they're really pretty they could go for all year round crafting or in your Christmas crafting I thought they'd be perfect for Christmas to be honest with the little um, like dimentis and the pearls I think they're really delicate and pretty. So you only get four. It looks like I'm missing a little rhinestone there. But I think they're lovely. Um, next we have these cute little fabric charms. They're like little round balls. And I thought these would be really nice either for like Maggie Holmes Marigold crafting or for Christmas crafting. Like I think these would go really nice with the Hey Santa collection. So what do you get? Two, four, six. So you get you get ten in this pack. And they're just nice little um, almost like plaid black and white dangly charms. In like a ball shape so very versatile they could pretty much go with any type of crafting that you're doing and then we have some gold deer or little gold reindeer you can either have them as deer or reindeer 
they got the antlers so maybe they're maybe we'll just call them um reindeer they're really nice actually i'll take i'll put some of them to the side so i don't have so many but these are really lovely just gold and they look like they're really good quality And I'm pretty sure you get 10 of those. So they're really nice. I'm really happy with those. And I love that they're gold and you could use them like, yeah, all year round, not just Christmas. They could pretty much go with any collection, really. So there's our little gold deer. And then lastly, I have these little charms here and they say no well i'm just trying to get a head start on all my christmas stuff because well really what seven weeks i think until christmas now it's crazy it goes so fast the year just flies by it's like we go straight out of like halloween crafting straight into christmas crafting that's how quick it comes up So they're the little Noels, and they've got like a little um, holly leaf and berries on there as well. And they are, I think they're like a white, yeah, they're, so they're white with gold and then the, like the little holly is um, like the red and green combo. And you get 10 of those. And then lastly, we have some other cute little, um, little pink Rudolph. And I know he's Rudolph because he's got like a little red nose. And you could get that in a variety of colors. I'm pretty sure I'm, I have a feeling they also came in white and I think maybe black. But of course, you know, knowing me, like I went for the pink. I prefer pastel colours with Christmas crafting rather than your traditional colours. So they are really cute. So I don't know if you guys can see like his little red nose on there. So there we go, guys. There's my little AliExpress haul. Um, I have more things on order. I pretty much always, always have things on order from AliExpress. <laughs> um, but not as much as what I have been doing. So, yeah. Um, I think I've only got a few more, like, dangly charms to come in maybe. And I think that's about it. Everything else is sort of kind of like little Christmas presents for Kris Kringles and things like that. So um, thanks for watching, guys, and um, I hope you enjoy these videos, and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care. Bye.